VFD is frequently used for speed regulation of AC motors or reducing the impact on the power grid on startup. Today, we are going to introduce to you a 1.5 kilowatt VFD with 220 volt single phase input and 380 volt three phase output. The packaging box will enclose an additional connecting wire as well as an instruction menu. This is the control panel. On the right side is the data plate. The fanning holes on the lateral side help with heat dissipation. The fan on the back serves as the major heat dissipating installation. Mounting holes are placed on the four corners. Control panels are available in different languages catering to the needs of users from different countries. The control panel is convenient for dismantling and replacement. Open up the terminal box. It can be seen that among RST input power terminals, the S1 has been removed, which means no connection needed here. UVW is the motor's wiring terminal. Terminals marked in red are optional for connection. This is the control terminal, which is equipped with RS485 port, X1 to X6 multifunctional terminal posts, FWD and REV terminals, analog input port, and relay output port. Now, we are going to connect the input terminal. Wire terminals R and T. Connect output terminals UVW to the motor. The wiring between output and input terminals is accomplished. The input current of VFD is 220 volt single phase, and the VFD will transmit 380 volt three phase current into the corresponding motor. The overall appearance and basic wiring process are shown as above. 